Hello, my captain, and welcome now to 2009. Well, sunny nesting and resting for the first half of the day for the Capricorns. That's because the moon is in a two-part day. As we wake up, the moon in Aries, putting emotional focus on nesting, resting, home, family, and foundation. So probably the best way to interpret this is you won't want to go to work. You won't want to get out of bed. But if you can make it to lunchtime or so, depending on where you live in the world, the moon will then transit into Taurus, which will mean that your inner child will be inspired. So expect a fun and childlike night this evening. Now, zipping on the Zodiac, it's your birthday period right now, Capricorn, and we're in Chapter 2 of the Capricorn Transit. Today, Venus is ruling the day. That puts a nice love, creativity, and compassion spin on the vibration. That also means it's an excellent time for you to go out shopping and experimenting with your new ego. That's what Capricorns do every year during their birthday period. We kind of craft a new ego. What am I going to look like this year? What am I going to react to this year? What am I going to put myself out there as? How hard will my handshake be when I shake people? It's your ego. It's how you present yourself. And in Chapter 2, we're still experimenting with what that 2009 Capricorn ego will be. So go out there and shop and experiment a little bit. Lastly, I want to talk about your ruling planet, Saturn. Saturn is officially in retrograde. It actually happened over the Christmas holidays. Saturn in retrograde means that for the next five months or so, you'll be tested on what you were learning with Saturn in Virgo. Now, for Capricorns, really in the last year, you were learning new belief structure, new faith, new philosophy, facing new religions. I know Capricorns that literally change religion. In the next six months, whatever it is you've changed in your belief structure will be tested. We'll see just how well that house was built. One last thing, Jupiter has officially crossed the border into Aquarius. Now, Jupiter is zero degrees right now. Jupiter is a planet that brings fortune and learning and expansion of awareness and thought. Jupiter and Aquarius does mean that for this year, Capricorns will be lucky with self-esteem and money, and that luck starts in about 10 days, so start planning. All right, Cappy, that's all I have for Monday. I'll see you tomorrow with more. Live, love, be. So